Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kanisha. If this is your first time here, welcome. So in today's video, I'm doing a haul. I picked up a lot of beautiful things and I cannot wait to share them with you. If this is your first time stumbling upon my channel, I focus on fashion, luxury, and all things beautiful. So let's get into the video. So first up are some coats that I picked up. I am like obsessed with coats. Honestly, I have too many coats, but was in need of some faux fur coats, some long ones. I have a few short ones, but I feel like the long ones are needed for a certain engagement. And yeah, so I picked up a few. So the first one that I'm going to talk about, it's from Zara. So here's the first one. It's from Zara. I got mine in a size small and it costs $1.99. I've seen this jacket on sale twice, but I was unable to get it for the sale price. I was uh, desperately in need of a faux fur, so I decided to just put it in the car and purchase it. But when it came, I was a bit underwhelmed for the amount that this cost. It does not look realistic. I think it's beautiful. It's very soft. It feels lush when you touch it. It feels so good. I think maybe if I would have gotten it for the sale price, then maybe I would honestly consider keeping this. Automatically tell that it's not real fur. And for $200, I expected it to be a little bit more realistic. So I think this one is going back. So with that being said, when I received this one, I noticed that it didn't have the look that I wanted. So I went online and I went on the Nasty Gal site and I saw one, it looked realistic online, but you know when you're looking at things online, you don't know if it really depicts what it really looks like. So I just decided to get it because it had a sale. So I picked up another coat from Zara. I've always wanted a coat like this. I feel like this is an adult puffy. It's sophisticated looking. It's just a nice looking puffer coat. I'm going to return this because it's not what I expected. Like I said, I wanted it to be heavier, one. And I also wanted it to be a little bit longer, two. And I kind of wanted the collar to be a little bit more exaggerated. I purchased this online. I didn't go in stores. So I saw it when it came in a package. And it's just... It's not what I expected. I purchased mine in a size small. If you live in a, an area where it's not as cold as where I live, and this is something that you've been looking for, I think it's a very nice coat. It's beautiful. I just love the style. I love that it has a hood on it. But I want something for winter. To me, this is more, I don't know fall or when it's almost winter. I wouldn't wear this coat in 30 degree weather. I know that Target has a similar coat to this one. So if you like this style, but you don't want to spend, yeah, this one, this one is $90. If you don't want to spend $90, I think Target had a coat similar because I was thinking about getting it. And I was like, no, I get the Zara one because it's better quality, but it's honestly, I think it's probably the same quality as the Target one. And the Target one was only, I want to say $50. I think it was on sale for $50 and I will link it. So this will be going back. So I purchased this beautiful chocolate coat from Nasty Gal. I really love this coat. Online it looked beautiful and I didn't know that it was going to actually look as pictured. I purchased it in size small. This coat looks really realistic. Um, let me see. It mimics real fur. Yeah, it's not buttons. It has clasps when you fasten it to close it. I kind of wish that it had buttons. I feel like the clasp can come undone. I live in New Jersey and I test this coat out when it came. It came during um, a time where we were having a cold front. It was like 17 degrees. And I wanted to test this out and it felt really, really warm when I wore it outside. It has a nice weight to it. Not heavy, but it does have a nice weight to it. The arms feel 
um, smaller than the actual coat itself. It has a lot of room in the body of the coat, but the arms feel average to a size small. And when I put this on, honey, <laughs> Listen, I feel like that girl when I put this um, faux fur coat on. You cannot tell me this is not real fur. It looks realistic, and that's what I was going for, and for the money that I paid for it, I'm so happy that I decided to get it in this faux coat, honey. If you don't have one, <laughs> you better click that link if they still have it on their website. I highly, highly recommend and if you don't have one, I listen, I really think that every woman should have a long laugh. This one reached me all the way to my calf muscle, not my, yeah, to my calf muscle, which is a great length for if you get dressed up, especially in cold weather. If you want to wear a skirt dress, you can put this on and you'll still be warm. I think every woman should have a nice, faux fur if you don't want to get a real fur like i'm obsessed with this coat i literally wore it the first day when it came and i'm looking for many occasions to wear this i think i'm going to wear this all winter to church and i'm going to step into work with this on because it's beautiful i i, I really really love this coat i cannot say enough about it i am impressed with the quality love 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 so guys the next item that i picked up is this black frankie shop hourglass i've been wanting this blazer for a while now but it's been out of stock desire this blazer put your email in and they'll alert you when it comes back in stock but it's been out of stock for quite a while i'm super excited to wear this blazer i have a lot of black blazer but this blazer is a little bit more special because of the hourglass silhouette you'll see when i try it out i purchased mine in the small and for reference i am 5'5 135 pounds it has quite a bit of room in it so if you're slightly bigger you still can fit the small the size and it's like a little i don't know and I can't wait to wear this blazer. So the next item that I picked up is this beautiful caramel color knit dress by Staud. Staud is another contemporary designer that I love. I love the sleeves on this dress. It's just beautiful. This knit dress is sexy, but elegant and classy at the same time then they did a good job i love the v on the collar area and the length of it it goes all the way down to i believe my calf and that's what makes it sexy but still classy because you show a little bit but then the dress the length of the dress makes it classy and sexy at the same time i cannot wait to wear this dress it Stad has um, great quality. I have a couple of their pieces, and it's just beautiful. Look at the sleeves. I love it. I, I cannot wait to wear this. It's cold now, so I think I'm absolutely gonna put this on. Look, look at this. So you'll see what it looks like on my body when I try it on and model it free, so you can see how this particular dress will look. But I can't wait to wear this. I purchased this from Saks. Yes. I'm going to put all the links down below just in case you're interested in any of these pieces. So the next two items that I purchased are from Sleeper. I love Sleeper. I have a few of their pieces. Uh, this pajama set is uh, very popular. I see it in black all the time. This white is so special, especially around this time of the year for Christmas. It's just beautiful. So it's a top and it has the bottom. You'll see it when I try it on. I purchased this one. My girlfriend and I planned a 
naughty or nice sleepover party if i have time i will try to upload that video even if it's just a small portion just in case it's something that you might want to do with your girlfriends so that's what made me want to purchase a couple nice pajamas i love pajamas i have several pairs but i wanted something just a little bit more special for the party so i decided to get this white one i already wore it it's I can't say enough about these sleeper pajamas. It just makes you feel special when you put it on. I don't know how to explain it. You just feel like, just elegant. It's beautiful. I love this pajama. I love it so much that I decided to get it also in the green. It's beautiful. The feathers are darker than the actual material, the actual fabric on the pajamas. I purchased both of these pajamas in a size small and these two items are investment pieces. They're a little bit pricey. Most people who have these don't just wear them as pajamas or loungewear. Most people <laughs> wear these out as clothing because that's what it that's what's awesome about this. You can wear it outside and inside. I plan on wearing this one mainly outside. I just, it's just so beautiful. Just make you feel so special. Um, I purchased both of these from Saks Fifth Avenue. For some reason, they're both size small. The green one fit better than the white one. The white ones are a little bit looser than the green ones. Neither one of them are tight by any means, but I just like the fit of the green one better. I don't know what happened why the sizing is a little bit off it's not a drastic difference but i just wanted to point that out that if you wanted to fit a certain way that you might want to go in the store and try them on i actually ordered both of these sleeper pajamas online so i didn't get a chance to try them on because i was in a rush and i wanted to get them for my party and they don't always have the items that you want in the stores that are local so yeah i'm super excited to wear both of these i plan on wearing both of these outside i already wore this white one to the party but yeah i'm excited and i will be wearing these quite often because i want to get my cost per wear i plan on mix and match and wearing it's the tops with denim sometimes or just wearing the bottoms putting on a different top mix and matching but honey I'm gonna get my cost per wear on these two beautiful pieces if it's something that you've been desiring or just want to have a nice little sleeper pajama set I highly recommend getting either one of these so the next three pieces that I picked up are from Banana Republic I got this classic basic black dress comes with a belt but I plan on putting on my own belt to make it more personalized and just add a little bit something extra to it it goes all the way to my cap I think it's an awesome dress for the office so you can look classy look like a lady and once you add a little belt or a brooch to it is just gonna give it a little bit of personality. I just love it because it's simple and you can make it your own. And Banana Republic has great quality items. I purchased many pieces from them and they have lasted many years. So the next item that I picked up from Banana Republic is this beautiful red crossover sweater. Red is one of my favorite colors and I plan on wearing this quite often. This is just a nice simple piece that I can see myself wearing quite often. Also purchased in a size small. This is just a nice classic sweater that you can wear to work. You can wear it on the weekends depending on your style but I love it. And the last item that I picked up is this beautiful blouse. It has pleats. Also from Banana Republic. Got it in a size small. It comes with a little cami. It's not under here at the moment. The colors on here are like a pink, burgundy, brown. It's giving me more of a fallsy colors, but you can wear it whenever. I purchased this one because it has um, burgundy hues in there. I have a Louis Vuitton bag 
that has that color in it and I would like to wear it more often. So I decided to pick up a piece that had that color. So then I would most likely wear it. If any of these Banana Republic items are still on the website, I'm going to put the link in the description box if it's something that you're interested in. These are just a few workwear items that I picked up. These are my Banana Republic items. So my next item that I picked up is this sweater that I purchased from Sheen. This is actually the first clothing item that I've ever purchased from Sheen. I really like to purchase items that are long lasting, that I can wear for years, that have quality. But I just, I saw another girl on YouTube. If I can remember her name, I'll insert her name. I like this because it looks simple, it looks classic. I plan on adding um, one of my Chanel brooch so then it makes it look a little bit more expensive. It's not the best quality, but I just love the style of this sweater. If I happen to see another sweater that looks similar, of course I will replace it. I don't see this sweater lasting long, but I just like the look for the moment. So that's why I purchased this one. If I don't like it, I can always give it to my teenage daughter. I think she would wear it. But yeah, I just, I would love to get a sweater like this of better quality because the quality of this is not that great. It doesn't look terrible by any means. It doesn't feel horrible either. And I would like, a sweater like this that I can have for years to come but for now this one is gonna do the job so my next item is this boutique silver Bottega belt all my belts that I have are gold hardware and I just really needed a silver belt so instead of getting a black belt with silver hardware, this is just a better option for me. I purchased this belt in a size 70, purchased from Saks Fifth Avenue. My normal size is a 75, but over time I can see that it fits, but over time I can see that the belt will get damaged. I'm going to try to exchange it for a size 75. At the time when I purchased this belt, there was no 75 available every time I try to find this belt. It was hard to find, so I just got anxious and bought the size 70. So the last item that I picked up are these black cargo pants from Fashion Nova. I purchased them in a size 5. They fit, but they're not fitting like they should fit. I should have gotten a size three. I just thought I could help someone else out. And just for reference again, I'm 5'5", 135 pounds. Definitely, if you're around my size, I would get these cargo pants in a size three. So guys, if you made it this far into my video, if you have not done so already please click that subscribe button and that notification bell so you don't miss any of my future uploads i just want to say thank you for tuning in and seeing some of these beautiful items that i purchased i'm so i'm like super excited to wear all of them and i hope that this helped you if these are some items that you were looking into purchasing and thanks for watching Bye.